Hey guys, Tech Commentary with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys how to mirror your new iPhone 13 or 13 Pro, any of the newer 13 lineup on iOS 15 on your MacBook running the latest version of the iOS. This is really straightforward and simple to do and very helpful as well. This is just an updated video in case you guys haven't seen our other videos. So it's going to be really straightforward. Of course, you will need your MacBook. Make sure it's updated to the latest version and your iPhone that you have right now this iPhone is running iOS 15 so when you want to do this it's going to be pretty straightforward first thing of course make sure both of your devices are powered on the next thing you want to do is take your USB-C cable because on the newer MacBook that's how you are able to connect if you don't have uh, the older version of MacBook which has the older charger so you're going to plug it in here and then once you plug it in go ahead and plug it in to your MacBook as well so find one of the ports to plug it in alrighty so once you plug it in you should see the charging happening here and the next thing you'll notice either you'll get a message popping up saying do you want to trust the device if it's the first time you're connecting and you're going to click on trust now the key thing here is to make sure right here where you see that of location on the finder app so this is the finder app you see that the phone that you have connected shows up if it didn't show up yet that means it didn't recognize the device yet just unplug and plug again sometimes you might have to turn off and on the iPhone so once you have done that now it's time to start the screen mirroring and to do that you're gonna want to search up an application called quick time so you want to search up quick time player and once you click on that you will open up that so once you do open up that it's gonna be up here it won't really pop up right away and you may not recognize it but on your left hand tie you'll see this QuickTime player now what we want to do here is do go to file and then after file we want to go new movie recording we're gonna click on that once we click on that it's gonna open up your webcam you're probably gonna see your face on it we have it blocked so that's why we're seeing a green screen here now to screen mirror it's going to be really straightforward where you see that dot to record next to it is an arrow pointing downward we want to click on that arrow and once we click on that arrow we're going to notice our phone that we connected now we want to select that and once we select that what's going to happen is it's going to go ahead and screen mirror our iphone 13 pro max right here and we'll notice that what we do on the iphone here simply going to just show up on our MacBook again if you don't have one of the newer version of it you might see a bit of lag but that shouldn't be too bad but there is sort of a slight delay again it's gonna be kind of per use cases but that's how you mirror your iPhone 13 Pro Max or any of the newer iPhones to your new MacBook so hopefully this video is helpful and if this video is helpful please make sure that like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time